This is FFPU, your primary source for Austrian film and TV critique, where two minds come together to take apart the work of people who actually matter. Welcome back to a new episode of FFP. My name is Paul and this is the 67th episode recorded on the 20th of December 2017. And he is back guys after a long hiatus. He, I got him finally back into the studio. It is... Can I say something before I introduce myself? Yeah, sure. You shouldn't say the, the newest episode because it's going to be podcasted. <laughs> and when people listen to it in two years, it's going to sound ridiculous. Yeah, that it's always the newest episode with every so, episode. Yeah, so say the latest. This is the latest, if you want to say latest. But the, the fact that they're stuff. listening to it Should right I start now. Over? Should well, I start? But I'm just saying the fact that they just downloaded it and yeah. they, they're just about to listen. They know it's the latest already. All right. Okay. Okay. Should, so, I, should I start over? No, you don't have to. All right. No, no. Hello, Dunkley. Hey, okay. Well, thank you for being here, man. It's great to be here. Yeah, it was it was it was nice because we watched Hundstage Dog Days. Thank and you for translating that for no, me. No, no, that's the, the American title. Okay. It's actually Dog Days. So they really just literally translated it, which for an Austrian movie is a, a rare occasion. Most of the time they, they use some stupid ass title to uh to cover their sins. Yeah, exactly. Yes. Yeah. And it's it's refreshing, basically, to see somebody. Also, the, the English subtitles were excellent compared to some of the bullshit okay. that I had to sift through. I thought you were going to say compared to the German that you had to listen to. <laughs> I, I, some of the German was I excruciating. Understand. I couldn't really understand. <laughs> no, so. it was, it was, yeah, it was all It was fake. probably better that way. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah I, I was grossed out at points and you were like, why are you... Why are you uh-huh. fidgeting so much? I'm like, didn't you just hear that? Yeah, no. <laughs> you're like, I heard it. Yeah. Just didn't. You ignored it. it. Yeah. No, I didn't ignore it. I just didn't comprehend it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah fair enough. So we watched a uh, dog days. It's it's hard to describe what what it is. Like it doesn't fit a certain genre except for. It's just like a char- character development type movie, I guess. Yeah, I guess it it has like a few stories in it. And a few characters that it follows, but it doesn't have a specific goal. It's like movie or, crash. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a little bit crashy. Yeah, crashy. The the it isn't cr- it is not crash. You <laughs> can't say that you can't say that this movie is crash. No, I'm yeah. just saying it is crash like. <laughs> yeah, a little bit crashy. Yeah, a little crash like. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. It. it, it it follows those 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 characters through their daily life and the obstacles and 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 just normal human well normal the <laughs> human interactions that they have with each other and other they other. weren't that abnormal so everyone isn't as squeaky clean as you think oh yeah and i'm not yeah. talking about me i'm talking about other people <laughs> all right let's let's move on in this case to the first segment Plot. So as we said, we follow a, a few stories and they are to a certain degree interwoven with, with each other, but they most of them touch each other only tangentially. Like you see two characters who are in the same place at the same time, but they don't really do something together, except for the security guy, I guess. Yeah. He was the most involved with everybody. Yeah. It's <laughs> Even though he's a horrible human being. Well... I mean, he's Austrian. So. <laughs> yeah, the, we, we already set a very low bar, right? Yeah, <laughs> you, I mean, you weren't surprised by the cruelties that his, they committed at all. <laughs> the first thing, uh, I, you know you've lived in Austria too long because he took the girl, he locked her down in the basement. Yeah. And the first thing I thought is, wow, that basement has more light than my, you know, my living room. <laughs> So they really, they really make those basements so that... Look nice, yeah. Yeah, you don't even know you're down there. <laughs> It's just like a regular room. Exactly. Yeah. Just, yeah. <laughs> just locked away and nobody knows it exists. Yeah. 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 That's, that's, that's how we live, basically. We, we, we lock all our shame and all our secrets in, in, into, into, the, into the, the basement. basement. For 22 years. And, and then it's crazy it that, well, it's not crazy, but it is, that was 2001. That was before all that 
before the, the internet b- before all that basement shit came to light basically you know he kind of predicted base austrian he, basement he just culture. brought it he just brought it into the light yeah <laughs> he he was like who every austrian aspired to be they're like he figured it out yeah. he, he had a whole nother house oh that's where i messed up they don't he even had a backup yeah. house yeah 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 <laughs> it, it was it was genius and sick at the same time he was <laughs> Yeah, it's 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 fascinating in that in that uh, uh, super villain kind of sense. Like, oh, yeah. this plan is genius. Yeah, it's super for it, it's you know. <laughs> <laughs> and everything. He was he was my, a superhero. My my, my my abducto fortress. Yeah. Yeah, my abducto fortress. That would be like the the the, the Sunday morning cartoons where they they just mashed up two names to make a cool new sounding name. Like the, the, the They only smash words together in German, just so you know. Oh no, no. They have the Technodrome with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, for yeah, example. Yes, so I never watched those kind I watched real cartoons. You watch the <laughs> Real you watch, Cartoons How you is Teenage, probably, How is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle not a real cartoon? It was it, I was too old when it came out. Yeah, and it's, see that's it's just cheesy and Yeah, you were the it's, it's not as good as the cartoons when I was little. G.I. Joe or what? No, I hated G.I. Joe. Okay, what was what 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 was the things you Just were? like Hannah Fat Bar- Albert? Yeah, Fat Albert was good. Yeah. yeah. Every Saturday morning. <laughs> yeah. Fat Albert was that was a great show. Come on now. And we no, had No, I love Fat Albert. They added here too. Like the, the ORF was deep into Cosby, which is kind of you disturbing. Was it in English or dubbed in German? Oh, they were all dubbed in German. Oh boy. Uh-huh. You got to find some of the Hi, hi, hi. Is that how you say it in German? No, I have no, no idea anymore. Okay. We should look that up though. <laughs> Fetzak Albert. Ich, ich bin fat. Or no, fat is, how would you say it? Fetter Albert. Dickes, dickes Albert. Dicke Albert. Ich bin dick. Oh, dick, dick Albert. Ich bin der dicke Albert. Oh, oh no, nah, they probably would have just called him Adolf. Yeah. Fat 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 Adolf. Hell, hell, hell. <laughs> All right, now that's too far. Come on. I'm trying my too best over here right. not to, to do right. Hitler jokes, and then you do that. Yeah, so. sorry. I thought you told me no Hitler jokes. No, I, I said no holds barred. Oh, okay. All right, well, this is pretty weak for no holds barred. Yeah, then d- yeah. wrestle it up, man. Come on, wrestle up some jokes. Okay. Wait, wait. Am I here <laughs> just to do some jokes? <laughs> That's the I only we reason were talking, why we were having a deep conversation r- about the plot. And yes, then, yes. And then we started... I derailing it yeah yeah it was derailed sorry as so they would say so in fa- <laughs> so um yeah it, it it follows like the the security guy is one of the main characters i think yeah there, there, there are some he's the only s- one who speaks i think in the whole movie <laughs> so well the only <laughs> one who definitely has agency in the sense <laughs> that he has to accomplish a task which is find find the the terrorist find the, yeah find the person who's been keying. terrorizing the whole neighborhood yeah by the keying their little cars, key. yeah which is which is the most suburban kind of terrorism you can think of it's except terrible. for except for um, i mean there was this thing about the gnomes in in Vorarlberg, where there was this guy who stole like a bunch of garden gnomes and everybody lost their shit that's how much we love our prior little that's gardens. That's how little problems they have. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy, right? In, in Austria, they just they have too few. So <laughs> we should raise the bar, right? Yeah, yeah. Do some proper crimes, you know. Well, it's some, still all relative. Proper crime here is the, crossing the, the street. The thing is, the thing is to really sell it in Austria. I think you have to make the crime organic. You have to make it, you know, recyclable. Bio, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bio, exactly. You, you have to probably, after you committed the crime, put it in a uh, designated bin, all the plants, yeah. so they are properly recycled. It's, it's a hassle to, be, to do real crime in to Austria. To be a gangster in Austria. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's uh, so much paperwork, yeah, man. It's, it's about, <laughs> there's about as many gangsters as comedians here. Yeah, it's, it's the same reason. It's yeah. just bureaucracy holds us back. <laughs> it's, we, we elevated bureaucracy to a... To a, to a to an art form basically yeah, in well. Austria because it does drive you mad. To I, I, I could make a really bad joke about, you know, the, all the records that were kept back in the day. But <laughs> so. No, it, you don't have to con- <laughs> <laughs> conform to that kind of joke. Yes, yes. I, <laughs> I got it, but we're, I'm going to keep talking. Yeah, it's, that's it's, fine. That's fine. Let's, let's, keep, let's keep walking. Let's keep talking. No, he, he is, 
yeah put in charge of finding out who who is the keen suspect the key suspect yes. in this in this whole thing and he gets pressured by the residents who already paid him and don't see any results yet yeah. and his master plan is <laughs> if you, I can just rape you want, somebody, you, everything will be everything will be okay. Suggested rape. <laughs> I mean, suggested rape is rape. I mean, come on. Yes, yeah, no, it, yeah. it is quite horrifying. Yeah, yeah. No, no, he 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 cold bloodedly picks up a girl, a random girl from from the street. Well, not random. He already met her. Yeah, she's also one of the key. But she's annoying too. So well, no, that's I'm, that's not beside the point. I'm just yeah. I'm her, just her, making her a, main her main character trait is annoying. Yeah, definitely. It that's, doesn't mean that you know that but, doesn't give you the right at exactly. all. No, no, nothing gives you the right. Like this is this is not this is not this is not. Uh, it's turning uh, into a Reggie podcast. Yeah, called yeah. code of Hammurabi. You know, <laughs> eye for an eye. That's not how it works here. Um, but it does in this case because, well, it's not even eye for an eye. It's not even car for, <laughs> scratch car for rape. It's just alleged car, car alleged. scratching f- for <laughs> rape. It, well, it, it wasn't alleged because she didn't even do it. So Well, he alleged towards the other residents that she did it, which means, right, he put the blame on her. Which yeah, is alleging yeah. that she did the crime. Yeah, it doesn't mean she did it. No, no, no. Yeah, not yeah. at all. In this case, not you don't even need the burden of proof. Because yeah, he, she just, just he just picked flat her up. Yeah. yeah, he just lied. So. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, and this is not on, not the most disturbing scene to me. <laughs> <laughs> no. This, <laughs> it's out there. Yeah, it's out yeah. There, it's, but it isn't... Ulrich I don't Seidl, know if disturbing, just the thing, surprising or... The, the thing about Ulrich Seidel and how he shoots and makes the movies work, because this is not the first time we covered a movie of his. Of course not. Yeah. yeah. He, he, he's, he's... Like, the, the movie I told you about, In the Basement, yeah. in, the, in Keller, in Keller, he yeah. made that. Yeah. Kid story, right? Huh? Yes. It? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. Yeah, it's <laughs> six and up. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Where did they hide the Nazi stuff? Was it in the... <laughs> it's like, like a quest. Okay, we already have two Nazi <laughs> references. <laughs> well, in this one, it's a it's a legitimate because that actually happened in the fucking movie. A lot of that happened. <laughs> so. right. um, yeah, so... He, he, Ulrich Seidel, he really, I think, makes everything seem mundane and tense at the same time. Like because it's it's just even when you see torture, it seems like something that actually could happen in this kind of scenario. That you have just somebody who's really unstable and 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 uh, af- afraid, I think, of himself too. Yeah. And his actions. I think Ulrich Sadl really really pulls out the essence here. It makes it makes it really. I don't know. I, I felt I felt I felt emotionally touched the whole movie through. Yeah. Like you know, uh, you know what kind of ruined it. Well, not ruined it for me, but yeah. I don't think the the character with the gun at the end. Yeah. I don't think he really sold himself as someone who was really crazy and was really going to shoot that guy. Mm-hmm. Like I never felt oh, the, the threat of. So it just seemed the, 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 a little the, fake and manufactured. To okay. Me. Yeah. Know. Especially because we saw him at the at the at the beginning being one guy who who tries to you know separate yeah. two people who are fighting yeah 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 yeah. Uh, yeah I think yeah okay fair enough uh, there there wasn't enough background that would have really painted him uh, painted him as an or unstable at least I person didn't, I didn't get person person yeah, yeah. You're, you're, Sean Connery you're Scottish <laughs> yeah person yeah but I just thought that yeah I never felt threatened by him so I didn't get the same tension I didn't see that there was even enough tension yeah between the guy and the girl for him to okay. be all well for me it's different it. probably because that kind of person threatened me already okay. so like i i i was in um two near fights and they were only thwarted by luck basically and it was always this kind of guy yeah who's like too much testosterone and and just i don't know uh kind of kind of uh 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 Disregard for for life, yeah, you're <laughs> kind hanging, of attitude. You're hanging with the wrong people. Yeah, I used to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That was my high school days. It was. Oh, I, wow. I definitely had 
hung out with the wrong crowd back then. Okay. Yeah. Well, at least you. I upgraded. All that. I upgraded yeah. to to stand up comedians yeah, way here better. With me. Yeah. <laughs> you are also morally pure. That's that's what's really attracting me to you guys. Uh, yes, I am the, <laughs> the purest. You are the, the pure. Yeah. Why yes. aren't you a saint yet? You know, the well, Catholic it's, Church it's, should have done that like years ago. I don't ago. want people looking up to me. Huh? I want to be a saint. Uh, yeah, you're, you're yeah. humble. Yeah, that's one yeah, of the yeah. same things. So I want to live like a regular person. And, uh, and then you know, afterwards. And then if one of the girls at the show see me, you know, right. you know, <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> this Vita Casa guy. You know. I actually did say that one time. Really? Yeah, someone randomly on the street heard me ha having a conversation. Yeah. And said, are you the guy who does the joke with Vita Casa? I was like, Oh well, yes. Really? Yeah. yeah how, really, how did it really. feel? How did it feel to be recognized on the street? It was just funny for me. Yeah. Because Vienna, to me, it feels like a high school. It just feels so small. Oh yeah, like, it is. It is rather small. I yeah. run into people that I know. On, yeah, I, on the if, regular. If I if I'm out for an hour, I'll meet like around Maria Hilferstrasse. So I'll meet somebody. Yeah. That I know. It's just every damn day. Yesterday I did. It's just it's yeah. like a high school. Yeah. So and then you meet people. And then you find out that they know somebody they, you yeah, know, they know yeah. someone else or mm -hmm. yeah so oh the, the the craziest thing that happened to me concerning um uh being recognized was during a birthday party of a friend yeah uh somebody came up to me and she was like you do cabaret right and i'm like uh yeah back in the day as well okay yeah, yeah. yeah. that was like five years ago okay and, and she i'm like yes and she's like i I know you. You 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 played there and there. I'm like, yeah, yeah. And she's like, I'm a big fan. I'm like, what the fuck is happening here? And then we we just chatted and nothing happened. I oh. was I didn't I, I didn't know truly, how to truly an Austrian story. I, I, yeah, I, I didn't know how to transform my my fame into actual uh, booty real estate. Wow, booty real estate. Yeah, that sounds like a <laughs> word you translated from German. <laughs> Uh, you want to join us at the uh, booty uh, real yeah, estate? Yeah, you're just getting. <laughs> you, you, it's, it's like it's so funny when you hear someone translate something from German, German to, yeah. into English, and they just take their words and they just like detach them into pieces. And yeah, and it's it, yeah, it. yeah, the booty real estate, yeah. and you're like, what? <laughs> and then you find out it's just uh, 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 um, he was talking about um, those uh, swimming houses. Sometimes you Bo just gotta stop. Yeah, booty, booty, real estate. After you get enough. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I cranked the juice out jokes, of this. You yeah. kept ringing it. Yeah, and ringing it. You were like, this is already <laughs> dry. But I'm like, <laughs> oh my God. so I mean, if you want to talk about Austrians, I could, I could talk for hours, all, uh, yeah. hours, yeah, days. So, yeah. <laughs> we can make that a separate <laughs> podcast. Yeah, the, the Austrian hour with Okello. Like, what's up with Austrians? Yeah. <laughs> that's just that's the, the name of the, the podcast yeah. yeah what's up with austrians yeah yeah what's up with those what with those schnitzel eating wine drinking motherfuckers uh and uh, that's well, literal the motherfuckers. It, it depends because you have to break it down in age groups because the age groups right yeah, yeah. yeah fair enough so yeah. uh like me i get along with all the young austrians most of them some of them are the ones i don't get along with they're too boring anyway they just go home every night and yeah They never leave the house anyway, so yeah, uh, shut-ins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, well, okay, nobody, and nobody they, really. Those ends are the up ones that turn out to be the grumpy old people. That's why they never go away. There's always going to be those. Oh yeah, that yeah. that ten percent sediment. Yeah, that of just the goes. Old stew, they stew in their own anger until yeah. they until they're old enough to go out on their own and start insulting people. Yeah, you know? <laughs> or it's start like or if period. they're fit enough, commit some hate crimes. You know, or, or that too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> But those are, but those is a whole other sect of the ones that outwardly hate people. So yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we do. We don't have any. Well, we, we have one racist caveat in this movie. Yeah, yeah. In one the, one the, blatant. The blonde, crazy dude. Yeah, yeah and yeah. his and his meatloaf friend. Yeah. Who, actual guys, look up meatloaf 2017 or 2016. There's a great picture that they took of meatloaf the musician. And he looks exactly the same way. They are both degenerates who have like liver cirrhosis. Yeah. Is that the photo you used to masturbate? <laughs> <laughs> Is that why you know how to find it so fast? It's on my spital. Yeah. yeah. 
I have, I, I, have a, I have I have a hard copy. I actually printed it out. I wow. don't trust the internet with this. I, I want it forever and ever. Yeah. <laughs> you want the guy at the lab to know you're a pervert. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, I got it developed. I wanted uh, some yeah. real high quality prints of it. All right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I just gave Paul the stare at his notebook like, all right. Let's yeah, get let's to let's the... let's keep going. Yeah. 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 Uh, Unless the off-topic stuff is more exciting than the movie. No, it's it both is exciting. I, I like I love talking to you, man. It's oh, yeah. man. <laughs> <laughs> and now he just spit on me. Yeah, oh, sorry. That was a uh, some juice. Okay. Sorry. Um, yeah, we 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 follow those people, and I mean that there, there are interesting moments, but I wouldn't again. Again, I wouldn't call it a storyline or something like that. It doesn't really yeah there's no. there's no there's no goal they have to achieve there's no there's no quest they have to fight it's it's i i, I think it it would actually really work in in that in the genre that now is in the u.s really really um taking off mumblecore if you if you know that i've one. never heard of that no. okay it's it's this mundane basically mundane low stakes we are just alive and this is our life kind of slice of life the japanese yeah, have that, it I mean, we've had that for a while i don't know what you mean by modern no but it, it 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 really went into into high gear with tv with the inception of tv and and we didn't have anything that was this highly rated by 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 uh, critics and and viewers outside of yeah that. So, okay. so, so I think this would be like a perfect representation of this slice of life mumblecore kind of thing, because the perfect example would be the Buzzfeed lady. Okay. Like, it's all nonsensical. It's all spur of the moment. I see. I talk about what I see, and if I don't see anything, I'm gonna talk some random shit. So like, this is. Uh, I don't even know who that is. The, the girl that Buzzfeed hitchhikes. The- Oh, yeah, because what, she, what did you call her the Buzzfeed Buzz lady? Because she has oh. more than one top ten list that she goes through. Well, oh, she goes Buzz through like okay. she, yeah, she goes like through five top ten lists in the in yeah, the, yeah, and it, probably all of them are bullshit. Oh, most just, yeah, yeah <laughs> she's just making shit up. Yeah, really, really, and she's singing like uh, old jingles. Yeah, I guess. yeah, I guess yeah, that's yeah, what yeah, it yeah. Is. some old commercial jingles yeah. and. She again. She's like the the random generator before the internet really was a thing. She just spat out random bullshit where you're like, oh, this is like a because some of the jingles I actually remember from my childhood. So okay. so some of that stuff actually was part part of my childhood, and it's it's weird to have this retro feeling basically that you get when when they. On BuzzFeed post this. These are ten commercials from your childhood. You yeah. will never believe what. Me, 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 me. Yeah. You know those kind of lists, and th- this is basically the movie representation of yeah, that. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, and she was annoying. <laughs> yeah, but that's her. Yeah, that, that, that's her Every whole scene was yeah, more her. annoying than the next, and yeah, she just, really upped the ante. Yeah, yeah. you were just <laughs> wanted to see who could take it and who couldn't. So. Yeah, exactly. I mean, that, that one guy just lost his shit. Yeah, for, for an Austrian. Security, yeah, for an Austrian, he lost his shit. He just pushed her. Out, well, not pushed her. Yeah, out, dragged her out yeah. of the car. But that's you know no yeah. violence still. That's like the Austrian way. Of well, hey, it's his car. Shit. You know, if you got a crazy woman in there. Yeah, you. So yeah, no, no, you have the total right. I'm yeah. totally on board with how the guy reacted, but I'm also I'm also kind of as somebody who has worked with uh, special needs people. Uh, it's they don't for the most part people like her don't mean any harm they, they just not, don't yeah. they just don't know how to socialize or see social cues or anything like that yeah there, there's just you know there's something missing there and as long as you can look past that you actually can have a really enjoyable time you just don't have to take everything so seriously basically yeah and no, and, sure. and some of the people actually like that, those were my favorite conversations. Uh-huh. Like the one old lady 
who was like, oh, I'm 50. I'm still a young, yeah. sprouty woman, yeah. you know? And she, she was talking about incontinence and making, yeah. making yeah. it really uncomfortable. Pee in your diaper. And, yeah. yeah, exactly. And she's like, no, no, I'm still young. It's fine. It's, it's all right. Yeah, she was like totally yeah, yeah, ignoring that it, yeah. aspect and going with the flow. And it really paid off. Yeah. I think. No, it did. She kind of just, you know, held her at bay. And I don't know. It, it It's just funny that, you know, some people can handle shit like that and some people can't. So, yeah. Yeah. But it was interesting. Th that part of it was interesting. Otherwise, I mean, there were, you were just trying to figure out, you know, how these stories connect you know, or, yeah, or, or, or so. what, what is actually happening. Yeah. Because the first guy we meet is Mario, the biggest asshole on the planet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah nice. Or, or let, let's just say the worst boyfriend you will ever have. Okay. Yeah. Right. He's, but they keep going back. She keeps going back. Yeah, yeah. 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 No. Well, she has her issues as well. Whoa, she has yeah, an eating disorder. Yeah. Apparently she, she, she's um, apparently uh, pushed into fame as Miss Lower Austria, yeah, yeah. which it's doesn't. A, it's a big title. In Austria, when oh, I'm sure. commercials and all that stuff, it's oh. not bad. You, you you go on those hayride thingies. Oh, that sounds like like those when they lucrative. do. Lucrative. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, raking in the hay, man. That's just. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> You're like a I'm just doing that because the audience wants to as well. So. <laughs> you are the represent. Do you the avatar of the audience in this case? The advocat. Advocat. Yeah. 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 Okay. Fair the, enough. The representative. Uh huh. Yeah. The chosen one. Uh, well, I'm not that far. So <laughs> just, nobody chose me. I'm just here. You chose yourself. Okay. Let's not get into any philosophical <laughs> questions. We, we have to go into some philosophical shit you chose here yourself. because. Because this show has some uh, philosophical. Speaking questions. of, you chose yourself. This is just randomly. Mm -hmm. uh, I was out, uh, and this girl asked me. Wait, now I forgot the point I was going to make. Cool. Uh, you're like, oh, lovely. Yeah, so, I, I want to listen to this. Yeah. But well, now I'm trying nothing, to. I'm, no. I'm trying to remember the point I was going to make about somebody asking me about. Oh, she asked me about my name, and mm -hmm. I said it's Okello, and then she said, uh, she goes, oh, are you into Shakespeare? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, but as if I was. I, oh yeah, and you chose I, your own name. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I, I mean, I can I come out of a vagina and start. Yeah, you know, serenading in, already. In Shakespeare, and I'm like, oh wow, he's really a fan. <laughs> let's You're name, like, you came out king let's with name King him Lear, uh, Othello, but with a K. Yeah. yeah, it doesn't. So I don't know why someone. Really, that was the the jump in logic. But of she her. asked me if I was a Shakespeare fan because mm -hmm. my name is Othello. It's just stupid yeah it's just that was a, that was that would have been a buzzfeed lady question <laughs> it would have yeah, been and, yeah. and, and you know what else uh people ask me what my name means my name means firstborn after twins and uh, all right that's yeah and then they'll ask me well are you born after twins i said no mm. well then how come your parents named you that they say because they didn't have google yeah and it's a good name it, it, i mean but what are they gonna do go google it there's yeah. no google when i was born yeah so <laughs> How would they know what my name means? And, yes. You know, it, you're not finding Okello in a book in the library. You yeah. Know, under boys' names. Oh. Okello. It's yeah. not going to be there. So how would they ever know what it yeah. means? So. Like. Yeah. Man. <sighs> yeah. Some, some that was people right. are It was off topic. Yeah. But it's just the, yeah. the, the, the lesson learned here is just yeah, people Don't pick stupid. up crazy hitchhikers. That's the lesson here. Fair enough. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Yes. Pick up regular hitchhikers. Exactly. Uh, ask them five questions before you let them in. <laughs> like, yeah. And if they spew any random shit, just don't let them in. There you go. Yeah. Let the right one in, in this case. Yeah, there yeah. you go. Good movie. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, what else? We, 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 oh, we have an odd, a random orgy scene. Oh, yeah. It, like, that was in interesting. Yeah. That was, that was pretty good. Yeah. Interesting lighting and and uh, yeah, that's yeah. that's again that's again this 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 uh, Ulrich Seidel touch. He has he had some sexy scenes before, oh, but yeah. they all look very matter of sterile. fact. Yeah. Matter of fact, like sterile. Yeah. Sterile. Well, the scene itself was very dirty. Like the scene itself Which was one? not the where oh. the twenty people were no, banging in the room. It was. No, it wasn't. It was very. It wasn't dirty looking. It was very. Like dreamlike, 
with because of the, the wall lighting, painting, the blue lighting, the, the wall painting. dolphin or the killer whales on the wall. There might have been which, some uh, dolphins yeah. in there. I, yeah, I, I've was, only had. I mean, it should, I would probably have a dolphin over a killer whale in, a, <laughs> in my sex room. Yeah. You know, so, I mean, I thought it was all very dreamlike. It didn't seem seedy or dirty or anything like that. Okay. So, uh, that one, it didn't seem sterile, but I meant the sexuality scenes earlier with the people laid out i mean it was yeah like even the first girl it just looked very you know methodical and mm -hmm. you yeah know, very unsexual you know right so, right right i know i know that's not a word but no yeah, I, I, sounds I, like I, a word i, Should get, be a word. I, I yeah. get the meaning i get yeah, the yeah. meaning yeah yeah fair enough no he, he yeah okay i i i see what you mean i'm, I'm just saying that what his what his he he doesn't put he's not voyeuristic in that sense like what some other other uh filmmakers would do where they go for a really close-up shot or something yeah but they did they, that he did that throughout though like with the woman kind of faking the blowjob and oh no no that was a separate scene they were no, in a no, separate I room but the, yeah. the, the orgy itself well, was you said very the, the director though so yeah i mean he kind of is like that but no those are two different types of scenes yeah but no, I thought the other one was wasn't. I didn't think it was dirty at all. So yeah, it's again, it's very interesting to to see that compared to an American movie, for example, that has an R. Because this would have been a this is a hard R in the U.S. Yeah, this, this is, is a the, very hard R. I mean, it's about the same as uh, Tom Cruise and um, Eyes Wide Shut. I mean, I would say it's about that. But the Ice I mean, White Shot thing is, is voyeuristic as hell. It's like Yeah, but this one was too. I mean It wasn't in the it wasn't in the yeah, it was in the way that it wanted to show you what is happening, but it wasn't uh, trying to entice you to get your dong out and just start jerking of course it. Not. I mean, with Ice White Shot, anytime, I I, with Ice White Shot, I would have I would have jerked my gherkin if I've seen that before the, the internet was a no. thing. Oh. Oh definitely. Which scene? The, the, the one, one where he's walking around? Yeah, and there are like 20 people banging. Yeah, but it's not... And you have you all don't, tits out. Not really. Not oh, yes, you do. And eyes wide shut. Oh, yes. Not, not as much as here. No, but it's different. In yeah, the way yeah, they, they, can, they, they show it. a lot more here. But I would say, it, I, I mean, for me at least, when, yeah. there's, when there's tension or something's going on in the movie, like when Tom Cruise is walking around and the music is playing with just a single piano note, yeah. I mean, that's it's hard to get your cock up for... Something when there's all the <laughs> tension, I mean, that's the last thing you're thinking of. There's sex, but you can't enjoy it. I just know? play it on a loop, man. It's just just that scene on a loop. Right, I've yeah. never seen the rest of the movie. Well, it's, <laughs> it's 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 a long, slow movie, but it's just one of those that I don't know. It, it's for some reason I like it, even though at the end you still have questions. Why I think oh, it's a cool movie. Ice White Shot is a real fuck you at the end. It's, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just like oh okay. Yeah. This, this happened. All I right. like a little resolution in my movies, but that's all right. Yeah. 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 Took us took us on a Tom Cruise, and it didn't pay off. Yeah. 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 He never even got any. Yeah. So. Yeah. That's that's a real waste. Not yeah. having yeah. an R-rated movie. No and, happy ending. And yeah. no happy ending for Tom Cruise. You know. Exactly. If you have that hot of a boy in your movie, use him. You know. There you go. Wow. Yeah. Like, objectively, Tom Cruise is good looking. You can't yeah, say that he's not attractive. Well, to I mean, obviously he's in a bunch of movies, so but I mean, I'm sorry, he looks like a regular white guy to me. Oh, like, okay. If yeah. I if I pass him on the street, I wouldn't think, wow, that's a no. Hot he has dude. white he has white dude syndrome, definitely. Yeah, but I mean, he looks like a regular guy. I, I mean, I understand that all a the women hotter like him, looking regu so, regular guy. But, yeah. I mean, it might be just because he his first role was in Top Gun, you know? right? So people. Oh, that was yeah. so gay. I love that one. Yes. I love that they Kilmer, reshot yeah. some scenes afterwards after showing the movie and inserted the whole love story in post, basically. Oh, really? Because Just, it was too gay. Wow. Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. yeah. No, that scene where they play volleyball, playing yeah. with the boys, oh, yeah. and everybody has their shirts off except, yeah. except for Goose, okay, who is ashamed yeah. of his body. Oh, it's boy. so yeah. fucking funny. It's so fuck. It's so yeah, gay. I, I try my best not to watch Top I, Gun I anymore. I actually watched Top Gun when they reshot it on a sixty millimeter film in Vienna. Wow. Yeah, it looks amazing. It's on on on, on film. It's mwah, great movie. Okay. And again, 
Those abs, man. Those abs. I mean, that's, <laughs> that's what happens when you're in your 20s. Yeah. 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 Uh, Wait, what? Yeah, uh, yeah so, right? Yeah, 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 yeah sure. technically true, yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I think it was last year, <laughs> uh -huh. or two years ago. So, no, but even the, the attractive people here have don't elicit that response from you. Uh, from oh, me, what? at least. This, this f feeling of arousal or something like that. Okay. It's just, you know, it's their daily life. Life, there's nothing s sexually special mm -hmm. about it. I think, and that's what what it makes it different to, uh, compared to. If uh, you say uh, so, Paul. Yeah. No, okay. that's just my. But right, if your you opinion. have a different opinion, that's fine. That's that's what no, I'm no, talking about. Of course, did. of course, I'm not disagreeing. <laughs> we with just you. agree uh, on yeah. everything. Like yes, yes. Sehr uh, gut, sehr yeah, gut. yeah. Ja. Ausgezeichnet, ja. ausgezeichnet. Richtig, <laughs> richtig, richtig. Richtig, ah. richtig. Yeah. yeah, I gotta practice my German. Ah, oh. yeah, not, we can. Not now. Yeah. No, no. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I think I think we, we 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 covered the plot in more of a meta way than a than okay. a regular. Well, but that's how step the movie step. is. Yeah. So. so find out for yourself, guys. It's 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 an interesting ride. Let's let's just put it that way. There you go. Yeah. But we, we we wait for the fin f final conclusion at the end. Uh, let's let's move on to cinematography. Huh? Isn't that redundant? Final conclusion. No, because we we draw <laughs> conclusion throughout oh, the conclusions throughout the podcast. Oh, really? Yeah, we uh, concluded that she was so annoying, we, for example. Okay. Yeah, and the final conclusion is the verdict. Should I just uh, call okay. it verdict? That sounds uh, verdict. Yeah. Yeah. Verdict or review or yeah, uh, yeah final. Fertig, fertig. Fertig machen. I don't know. <laughs> fertig machen. Fertig ich habe machen. ich habe gefertig gemacht. I don't know. <laughs> Your German is so American. <laughs> it's 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 amazing. It's like it's like wanna, Arnie wanna, speaking wanna, English I is keep your it that way. way speaking German. I want to keep great. it that way. I'm you say, could you could become our Arnold ich, Schwarzenegger. Ich bin ein Österreicher. That's a, huh? awesome. Yeah, awesome. That sounds amazing. <laughs> you could also, I guess, in this case, say ich bin ein Berliner. Yeah, I know. Like, no, no, but yeah. say it. Then you mean like as an American? No, as ich bin John, ein John, F. John, John F. Kennedy. Ich bin ein Berliner. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Which is, you know, just. See, and I, Berliner I, is the. I didn't know I did impressions. The sweet. I didn't know I did impressions. Yeah. I, I was just surprised yeah. myself. Yeah, discovering new things. Yeah, but no, I, I'm not going to. I don't want to get rid of my. I don't want to sound. German or Austrian. Oh, no, no, that would, would be a I huge waste. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I, I try, but <laughs> mm -hmm. I mean, German makes, it makes your face look, look Tense. angry. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so, Dude, I have more, I've, I already have more. You have stronger face muscles from speaking German. Yeah. So. <laughs> if somebody punches me in my face, nothing yeah, happens. It just, breaks their wrist. That's exactly. all that happens. Exactly. I just make my regular face and it's already so tense. Yeah, those like muscles steel. just, yeah. It's like <laughs> armor. Exactly. Um, all right. Um, yeah, c cinematography. Um, do you do anything that stood out to you? Like visually? Um, you, you said about the, the, the um, geometry or the, the... Yeah, the composition. Yeah, the composition like, of the shots. That it was either centered or there were diagonals. Everything was just super neat, super clean mm -hmm. cut. Everything had lines and... Uh, the colors were just all very mute, muted. It just seemed like a really that like, might have been also part due to the DVD release. No, I don't or, think so. No, no, because this was shot on film. So yeah, but I don't. I mean, this it, wasn't it, a digital release. No, but you can tell the mood that yeah he they was wanted to, to convey. Yeah, to mm. convey. So um, no, I thought it was. It just looked like a photographer was setting up the scenes and mm -hmm. he was just trying to yeah paint these pictures and even if. Even if the character isn't amusing, at least make it visually amusing, just to pleasing. Yeah, yeah just to kind mm -hmm. of, you know, give you something to kind of look at during the scene. So yeah, uh, no, I thought it was shot, shot well, and you know, I because they sometimes even if they had static shots, sometimes it was apparently handy cam. Okay. Where where the frame moved a little bit, like okay. I, I found that very interesting. Is that like to to make it look like that that is 
it's through the viewpoint of a person because uh-huh. you're you're never yeah, looking just the straight, same, yeah. yeah just straight or is it just we didn't have money for a tripod <laughs> because you said yeah, you said this movie looked cheap at, I don't, at one point you said it was like a thousand bucks to shoot this and no I, I didn't oh yeah you, wait 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 you asked me about a uh, like a switcher Is oh that, that was uh, no no I've, I asked you a diff- at, at some at some point I asked you about the movie and and you said or it, I just misheard you. You must have misheard me. Okay, fair enough. But no, this, no, no, no. I, did, not, I, didn't, I never thought that. I'm no. trying to think of when you even mentioned just that scene. Okay, was, fair enough. No, no, okay. no. no. Let, let's, let's breeze past no, that. No, no, I didn't think it was shot yeah. cheaply. I thought, if anything, I was thinking, wow, this, this was an expensive shoot because it seemed like... The night things, shots, especially. Yeah, it seems like things were probably built like just to make it more symmetrical and right and right i mean it seems or like you have some excellent location scouts or that yeah, yeah it, they might have just been all everyone looking just for we have symmetric we have we've so. had three thousand people to look at locations yeah yeah and <laughs> it actually might be cheaper to build a set at that point but, yeah exactly but even even when they would show wide shots of houses it was always you know this neatness to it so uh-huh. yeah it, and it's You know, I, I'm sure there's some kind of correlation between how neat everything was and, and how messy the yeah, lives of the yeah, people are. Yeah, it, it's like, you know, let's make sure we keep this in order that everyone sees, and then all the shit going on in the background. Mm-hmm. You know. Oh yeah, that's, that's definitely happens. one of Ulrich Seidel's main messages in his movies: is that nothing, that nothing uh, is as it appears. That there's always something hidden beneath the surface okay, even yeah. and that most of the time even if it's a physical representation like a house it still uh, hides something inside that is maybe sinister or 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 for some stigma has to be hidden yeah. it's it's Ulrich Seidel really has a as a has a neat eye for that and the 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 cinematography represents that. I, I especially love the dusk scene where the guy plays tennis in the in the oh, yeah. in the pool. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that one was amazing with the with the blue color coming yeah. in from the from the dusk and uh-huh. the two guy uh, the 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 the, 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 gar- uh, the the lawn lights still on uh-huh. and and that warm light illuminating him in inside the where he's basically he he is caged. He tries to break out, but he can't. That's what he is in that moment in that in that pool, I think. And I, I didn't really, read all that into it. No, he got super angry with his ex-wife, and 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 he had to break out of this 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 terrorizing this terrorizing uh, 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 feeling that he gets while living with his ex-wife. I think this this is this is all a metaphor for him. You know, trying to, oh, you know what it is? Maybe he is like he was a professional tennis player at some point or something yeah. like that, because he he the the whole tennis thing was mm-hmm. like an obsession with him. Yeah, yeah. Maybe and his prime days are over, and that's why he doesn't have to work anymore because he already made all that yeah, money maybe. making tennis, doing yeah, ten, I mean, winning tennis cups or something like it's that. It's kind of a big stretch to me, but yeah, no, it's a really <laughs> but, nice house, yeah. and I don't yeah. know why. I don't, and maybe he put all his money in that house, <laughs> and that's why he can't split it with his wife, ex-wife. Well, well, I wasn't a very good tennis player then. Yeah, <laughs> it'd be only man I'm, enough to get I'm, a house. I'm, half one, a house. I'm, I'm one house famous. Okay. <laughs> I'm one house famous. That's how famous I got you, as a you tennis just player. Just made some guy a really famous tennis player. Yeah, <laughs> and then he told him in Austria. he's shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> No, he had a drug problem or something. Lost course, a lot yeah. on the market or something. The crash of no, the Y two K crash. Yeah, if if he was on drugs ever, he would instead of going in the pool, he would just went shoot up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah no, I, yeah. So so that scene was really nice. I really liked that. And they 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 put an eye also on. I think uh, um, what was it? Let me let me just look it up. Uh, for example, the the rear view mirror scene, where we have the BuzzFeed girl and one of the guys, the the, the middle aged guy. I don't know. He never yeah, shows just, up again. Yeah, just one He's, and done. Yeah. yeah, he they 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 have that scene where the camera looks into the rear view mirror mm-hmm. as well, and that was just 
I think perfectly framed yeah, yeah, for, for for especially if you if you consider that again it's an Austrian production and to have <laughs> to shoot that probably in a normal car without yeah. any super fancy second car equipment or something like that they can't really have a crazy crane probably for that uh, so they they that all had to be handheld probably to I a mean yeah degree. it was I'm sure it was mounted because yeah it wasn't too stable for, yeah, for being handheld for, yeah, yeah so I mean, it, it only went off camera a couple of times. So it yeah. was pretty, so it was probably pretty solidly on the mm-hmm. car. Um, but yeah, it was a cool scene. I've not really seen something like that, but yeah. you know, kind of having eye contact of both people and it was almost like a split screen, but yeah, just right. Done it, it was cool. A, it was a, cool. In they... a legal way in a movie. You know? Huh? Just done in a legal way in a movie. So Really? Like, well, I'm just saying instead of, Oh, okay, literally, yeah, yeah. Literally, literally doing the split, split screen. screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is this is the, yeah. the next best thing. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. And it's all that makes sense. Yeah. Yes. Yes, it does. Yeah. They again, really good eye for that in general. There's there's really nothing where I was like, oh no, this shot is totally idiotic. They even made the ass of the guy symmetrical when they put the candle in his in oh, his yeah. butt. Yeah, yeah. No, I know. <laughs> we I didn't said even that. talk about that yeah. yet. Oh, I said it during while no, we were but, watching. Yeah. Butt candle, though. Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Everything has to be symmetric. Yeah. Especially if there's going to be a light there, you know. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> you I, have to I'm center just, that. Yeah, yeah. Just trying to imagine them shooting that. And it's like, <laughs> all right, we're lit up. Are we centered? And, you know, hold on. Candle needs to move to the right. And he just moves his <laughs> ass to the right a little bit. So, I mean, that guy's got to be thinking, you know, how many takes what the do fuck you, did how many takes agent, did, did they have to take? Yeah, I know. <laughs> like, what did my agent, you know, send me to? My contract says yeah. five butt candles and not more. <laughs> yeah, you better get it right on the last one. So, or maybe don't drop the candle, man. Maybe don't. he wanted another one. Like, what? Are we done already? Yeah. yeah. So, come on, just keep yeah. keep putting in yeah. there. Can I take these home? So. <laughs> Free candles. There Nobody wants them yeah. anymore. <laughs> just, just don't burn them. You know? Yeah, exactly. It starts to smell funny when you get to the end. So. <laughs> I still have to uh, make a Christmas wreath, you know. There you go. <laughs> I need at least four candles, so keep it going. All right. Do that after I leave. Yeah, that, that yeah. okay, that, that snuffed out quickly. So, all right. You always have to keep... <laughs> Keep going. Yeah, oh, just one step let too me far. Ring this last. Uh, <laughs> it's already dry. Yeah. So. <laughs> All right. Sounds. Because there were only like three songs that they repeated over and over in this one. Yeah. And they were all right, I guess. I mean, from a sound pers- perspective, I don't have a lot to say because except for the Vien- really authentic Viennese or suburban Viennese ex- accents there was not the dialogue was good to a certain degree when there was if dialogue you, if you say so yeah. yeah I mean I mean for example where um, uh, Georg Friedrich's uh, character uh, Lucky, the guy yeah. with the gun uh, uh, the, the, the limp, tortures huh? oh, go ahead what it was like limpy Dicky yeah limpy dicky that was first of all a great translation because it didn't say that at all okay but they wanted to make it a rhyming scheme yeah and convey the message and they perfectly did that so okay. that was excellently done uh Willy? or what was his name so, the other Vickley, guy wasn't it or something Vickley? something like that. yeah Willy with the small dickly small willy Something sure, like that. Something, something like, like that. that. And they again, they perfectly translated that. And also, it was just very well done. The whole dialogue thing, especially his confession, where Lucky confessed to being a shit, yeah, shit person the the day before, okay, and yeah. talking to her. It's less. A, it's more of a monologue, but. It still was very well written, I think, because okay. he tracks back and is like, "No, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, and yeah, I can't take it back anymore." But really, I didn't do anything bad. Yeah. And then he's like, "But I am sorry," and like crying and all that, yeah. weaving in and out. I think that was really powerful, and the writing really shines through. And that's again, sound with the dialogue, what, what, the way he conveys it was very powerful. I think. I well, don't know how you felt during well, that. Well, I think. 
you ate I, popcorn I, I during that. You're like boring. I hated all the sound because it was in German, and I yeah, it. and it was <laughs> it's a just white noise. It was just a different German than I yeah. heard. So some things I would understand, and and yeah, so. It's hard, for, and plus it, the volume wasn't so high. I yeah. mean, not that it would have made a difference. It was just, I mean, it wasn't the volume, but sometimes they would just mumble or speak mm-hmm. really low, and I, I just yeah. have have no shot. But I mean, we didn't have any kind of five point one setup, so I mean, it's it doesn't it, have this the, movie the, doesn't exist for sound the, anyway. Yeah, so. exactly. Yeah, it's more it's of a visual, visual and yeah. dialogue, so that you understand yeah, what's going yeah, on. So I don't think sound was it, that yeah, particular that outstanding applicable or yeah. anything so mm, all right yeah it was good enough good genug good genug yeah, yeah. all right genügend uh, genau genau yeah yeah genau yeah that's that's the that's the grade you want to see on your kids school reports Wait, right genau genügend oh genügend yeah the C? nicht is that that's C? a d oh genügend is yeah. d oh okay yeah it's an e failing grade is e yeah five Nicht genügend. Yeah, well, obviously. <laughs> Which yeah. is so passive aggressive. It's like, you're not good enough. Uh, yeah, not even enough. <laughs> yeah. You should just say some <laughs> or it needs more. Right? Yeah, uh, nope, nope. Yeah. It's, <laughs> you're not good enough, yeah. son. Go back and get some therapy 20 years later, you know? Yeah. <laughs> no. Um, Best moment. What what mm. what was what was what was it for you? What 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 sold the um, movie for you? Best moment. Uh, I'll have to think. Is that well? I guess uh, it was when he locked her in the basement because you mm-hmm. felt like, okay, here comes some tension. Yeah, like he somebody just fucked up, and now something's gonna happen. I guess it did, but I don't know. It just kind of happened, and then it didn't happen. So you know, it, it seemed like. There were no consequences. <laughs> she didn't go to the police, and she just didn't seem that upset. Think, so, yeah. So, um, so I, but I thought that was good. I would have. I mean, I, I know when I say this, it makes me sound American, but I would yeah. have liked something more exciting to happen when he did that, or you know, or afterwards, some kind of repercussions some payoff. or yeah, payoff or something. But yeah. then Well, the payoff like, is that and, he and, he finally resolve the situation by fi- f- finding a scapegoat and getting his money yeah but and selling a shit ton of security systems yeah but you're not supposed to get away with stuff like that in movies oh really you know? yeah <laughs> yeah or oh, the bad guy wins yeah that's <laughs> unheard of right well, i'm just saying <laughs> that's it's, not how it's supposed to yeah, be <laughs> it should be some kind of i'm like it, i guess it did have a happy ending for someone so yeah i get yes i guess so kind of yeah, yeah. the the, the the couple that lost the the, the kid kind of had a, a, a moment resolved yeah, yeah. It was, uh, at least the first step of <laughs> it's, it's gonna <laughs> it's gonna look like I have the, the thought in pauses, my head it's so f- immediately the, yeah the word's gonna come up yeah Ooh, yeah boy. yeah I'm I'm, I'm just come on, on the podcast I look yeah. like a fucking genius <laughs> yeah until they see the camera cut. Oh, that the camera is. I'm, yeah. uh, that's why I only cut all, I cut a best off together. You know, it's yeah, just, of course. I'm gonna make myself look this good. Whole you know? recording is gonna lead to probably like eleven minute podcast. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's gonna be like forty minutes probably, okay. but <laughs> we'll, we'll see. Be here all night then. What was my original point? Uh, you were talking about the best moment. Yeah, and I was saying that was my best moment. Okay, the locking in the basement. Yeah, the, that was yeah. that was really good. Yeah, that that. That definitely was one of the better ones. I I particularly enjoyed, well, enjoyed is the wrong word, but I particularly found interest in the old guy and his dog and his, I don't know, stand-in wife, I guess, yeah, or his the, new girlfriend, his stripper wife, his girlfriend. Yeah, yeah, and and that scene exactly that scene, uh, really really sold it. The 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 whole. The whole process of them them eating together and then him hiding hiding a present for her yeah. and I don't know what in what was in the present actually they never showed it. it was, uh, it's just something for the anniversary. Yeah, I don't know. exactly. And then so and then and then afterwards this little striptease that he gets and it's just you know this shit's gonna 
hap- be happening right now you know yeah. some old folks who are still getting down and dirty you know and that no it's just it's just nice again it's this humanizing thing where it's like yeah we are all humans even if we're all and ugly and sp- all used up yeah we still are human beings and we still like to enjoy ourselves you know yeah. and that was just really nice to see and that again this humanizing factor is something that really sells all the saddle movies to me at yeah. least yeah and that was yeah just no, brilliantly I made so. i mean they seem like regular people and yeah you're just having yeah just uh, having a afternoon striptease you there know you go. Yeah. yeah gotta go to sleep at eight you know <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> Gotta take an, at least double the dose of the heart medications, otherwise you're gonna die during this. <laughs> yeah, you gotta give yourself some time to, you know, rev down a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, you <laughs> have the blood pressure sleeve on yeah, exactly. the whole time, <laughs> just in case. Heart monitor. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> you have you have to make it sexy, but under 180 uh, yeah. beats per minute sexy. There you you know, <laughs> not uh, too sexy, it's, it's lady. Slower music. Yeah. I think that's also maybe one of the reasons why people get ugly with age so they don't kill each other during sex like get this is too exciting ah! no they just get old so no if it like it would be it would be easy relatively easy probably genetically to make us look the same way we used to when we we're 30 but really? we're internally we are totally so? fucked yeah. up we're to- internally totally fucked up so if a 70 year old with a 30 year old face has yeah. sex with another 70 year old with a 30 year old's face yeah it's gonna be too hot and they're just gonna have a heart attack both of them because it's too exciting and they're gonna die wow, that's, that's why that's, that's why fantasy. people that's why people get ugly with age okay yeah. if you say so yeah that's my theory i'll, I'll tell your mom you said that <laughs> please don't <laughs> I don't think your mom listens to it. No, I don't think anybody listens to this. Oh, fuck still, you. Fuck you. I still don't know. Who. Fuck you. Yeah, nobody's ever stopped me on the street. Like, are you the black guy that was on Paul's show? <laughs> For that like, one yeah. episode? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. That's so, that's how people But you didn't even it. film it, so. Yeah. yeah, exactly. They wouldn't know how you look. Just from the voice, probably. I guess so. I yeah. mean, you have I the most... Rec- sound uh, like I have I a guess black next to, voice. So. Again, again... Uh, I think you and Luke Hacker have the most most distinct voices on my podcast. Well, Luke is just because he speaks fast. So yes, he. He's I, I, I can talk 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 talk. talk, 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 talk. No. <laughs> no. Yeah, please try it. That was a miserable. It, no, attempt. it would. That it was, would. I no, because it would it would make me too nervous to to actually to improvise. Talk like that. like no. yeah. So I don't even want to think about it. Oh yeah, yeah you you have to think about each word yeah. before you speak. And, it, and, and then you have to say it twice or. Oh times. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it is it must be held to be in luke's body no he just in luke's it, mind just says it twice and you know it just means yeah, exactly. people understand him better how much how much yeah. work is that that's yeah. like double the it's work twice as, yeah. twice as much so see, it's good he, that we figured can, out that math he can right make his sets like twice as long and <laughs> just stop doubling up on every phrase. i have a 40 out 48 <laughs> hour set <laughs> no instead of having you know, 15 minutes worth of material, all of a sudden he would have a half hour. Yeah. Or no, actually it would go the other way. 30 minutes of material would be 15 minutes. So Right, That's a yes. math, math person. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I'm like, Nailed it. Why, Nailed why, it, yeah, Ocala. Why is, you know, yeah. it must have been something before the show. All right. I, 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 I don't really have anything for the secret category because... Or is it, it, it just it, a secret? It's so secret. What's you, what's you the biggest? Tell me. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> what's the biggest? What's the biggest secret you think one of those people, one of those characters have? Because again, it's it's made up, but some of the the shit went went really sideways for some of the characters. So they must have mm-hmm. done some shit before that. What's the biggest secret? Uh, the biggest secret. Well, I guess the biggest secret has to be the the guy who was allegedly raping the girl uh-huh uh, oh do you mean the guy in the in the in the in the slavic uh yeah in the sweatsuit oh the, wow he with the and with the with the with the sideburns with yeah. the sideburns and the and the shitty mustache all of it yeah he, yeah he was he was the epitome of i'm gonna instantly hate this guy you yeah know? so i mean there's some secrets going on there because he had no problem just 
Maybe, maybe yeah. he's maybe he really is a literary professor at the University of Vienna. Maybe that's I, his biggest. Secret. I never said he wasn't. That yeah, was, <laughs> you can be both of those—a guy who goes into a basement <laughs> and you yeah, know, a literary. That's expert. the freedom yeah. of choice of humans. Yeah. You can be anything you want to be. There you go, and people do it. No, those are always the one you last, the ones you last suspect. Again, just for safety's sake. FFP doesn't advocate any of those things. Yeah, you, you have yeah. the freedom of choice, but choose right. You know? Yeah, you've said worse than mine. So. <laughs> you don't have to warn them for that. <laughs> Just a safety disclaimer, you know, at the end. Gotcha. Yeah. For, uh, for me, for me, I, <laughs> I was interested in, in uh, what, the, what, what put the teacher, the one that was, uh, you know, Messed up by Lucky and the other guy, yeah, Meatloaf, Fat Meatloaf. Yeah. Um, what 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 was her backstory? What what motiv- mo- motivated her to be with that guy? Again, she's a teacher, so she has a yeah. certain social mm-hmm. stratification, and she hangs out with the most horrible human being ever put on this earth. Well, I mean teachers get freaky too i mean yeah no 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 that's yeah. fair yeah, yeah I, I mean f- teachers definitely get freaky yeah, i mean i mean uh, we 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 caught one of our uh high school uh pe teachers masturbating in his room wow. in his in his pe room dang he that's didn't crazy. lock the door that was his mistake uh, and maybe it, was it this, wasn't a mistake it was the maybe teacher's room it was the teacher's room it was yeah. definitely a mistake he it was definitely probably got off from you guys walking in like, <laughs> sounds like it oh no he was definitely super ashamed <laughs> did he get fired oh no no we didn't tell anybody it wasn't, oh, really? it was an honest mistake an honest mistake got, dude there, there were people jerking off in our school all over the place it was okay but it the, was bad the fact that the story still comes up just like that oh yeah <laughs> you know 20 something years later uh, it wasn't 20 it years was, i was 18 at that point oh okay right. so you were an adult so yeah, that maybe, school. maybe he wanted you to join him <laughs> can you help me unravel this old wrinkly dick you know the, well i don't know how that stuff works i'm not uncircumcised that's disgusting oh okay so, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wrinkly, you don't no. have to you don't uh, have to peel wrinkly, the no. banana every time uh no it's, yeah. I don't, yeah. you don't you don't have to scrape yeah, uh, scrape always, for, for, for cas. yeah i don't know which, which is one of the dis- yeah, most disgusting the awesome same, words well the same way i i treat uncircumcised yeah. penises like vaginas i know that they have to do certain things but i wouldn't know exactly why what oh, like, okay how to do it like I mean, well, I, I, you never experienced a, 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 a foreskin, so you will yeah. never know what it really is like. I know. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I was like very a vagina. Young, yeah. Uh, very young when they took it, like a day old. <laughs> when they so. took it, it's like yeah. they, they <laughs> robbed they stole you. Of it. It. <laughs> they did. They just. Oh, but if you had the decision now, would you still do it? Uh, yeah, yeah, probably. Or yeah, if, I'm used like, to it, or cause... if you had a foreskin now, would you like test drive the foreskin for a while and see what feels and then better for seven days? Yeah. <laughs> or your money back yeah, yeah exactly yeah return <laughs> your are, you return your foreskin in i will not pay days. a lot for this foreskin <laughs> so you don't even get that because it's an american commercial <laughs> again do it again yeah it, it's well the commercial was i will not pay a lot for this muffler oh okay it was, no it no. was like a major i thought camp- it was like geico or something no like no it's a major campaign okay for mufflers of, yeah a it, muffler campaign well that's why it, it worked because okay. they had that phrase yeah. and it would always be like someone who's, they would give him a price and he was like, I will not pay a lot for this muffler. <laughs> and then, you know, <laughs> and the fact that I remember that commercial about a muffler means that it was fucking it, well, yeah, genius. Yeah. The, the marketing campaign so, worked out. Yeah. So when people say that of, of my age mm-hmm. uh, and you say, I will not pay, pay. It, that'll be the first thing that okay. pops in their head. That's so like, that's where's why, the beef? It, exactly. Yeah. So, that's why I said, you know, I will not pay a lot for this Or got milk, I guess. Yeah. Keep walking all over my lines here. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's okay. Uh, it's it's just you, you, okay. Triggered, no, you triggered me with American commercials. Now listen- they're all in my nobody's head. Nobody's listening anyway. So At this point, no, yeah. no, 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 no. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what, what American commercials do you remember? Huh? Yeah, Which the ones? got milk campaign. Yeah, but that's not, that wasn't really a catchphrase. Got milk? Not really. Where's the beef? Where's the beef, yeah. Yeah, like, that, oh, that was Wendy's, about, I think. It was Wendy's, yeah. yeah. Then uh, oh the the old uh, before I'm loving it in Austria yeah. you know what it was da, 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 da. 
You mean the McDonald's? Yeah, the McDonald's yeah, yeah. slogan before it was "I'm loving it" uh, in German. Ich ich hasse it. Na. Yeah. <laughs> ich kann's gerade aushalten. <laughs> I, I can get excited. No, I'm 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 okay with it. It's like oh, really? it's not too bad. No, no, no. The real slogan, the real slogan was uh, "McDonald's schmeckt einfach gut." Okay. Just simply tastes okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, good is only okay. Good is sehr good is excellent. Okay. Is good it, is good is a two again. Good is all right. Passable. It's all right. No, that's good genug. That's 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 no, so you, close to trash. So so what's great is sehr good or ausgezeichnet aus, sehr ge, sehr gut um, wunderbar perfect all of those things. I think we 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 superlative more than you do, guys do. Well, no, but we just have. You can just put ist on everything. So. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You guys don't. You have umlauts. That's about it. Yeah, that's uh, the umlauts most exciting and, thing yeah. we have in our language. Oh, yeah. and the scharfe s. Yeah, the the hot s. Yeah, my my sister. Uh, scharfe s. My sister just sent me a package. <laughs> because it's boobs. Will you let me talk? Sorry. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I don't want to talk. No, what's the package? Yeah. What what? No, what it, did it just had. Uh, it had the sharpest S. Yeah. But it's funny to see how people write it that don't yeah. write it. So oh, it, okay. it, looked, it looked all funny. I was like, oh, so. <laughs> is that an yeah. ampersand? I don't know what yeah, it is. Yeah, I don't know what it is. <laughs> Hieroglyphs, so. basically. Yeah, so she was, as she's writing it, she's yeah. probably like, I don't know what this is, but <laughs> sure. it's not a B and it's not. Uh, uh, so, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so. that's that's what I see most people in the internet. Like, if they yeah. see that letter, they're like, what is with, with that fucked up B, you know? Yeah. Because it kind, of, at least the printed version of it does look kind yeah, of like a fucked up. Say, I want to send this package package to Joseph Stater Strauzy. Uh, Strasse, or Gasse. No, or Strabi, she would say. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, because yeah, it's yeah. be yeah. Jo- Joseph Stater Strabi. Oh, that's hilarious! Yeah. Oh, that's so, hilarious! <laughs> that's not that funny. <laughs> I messed up it, the line the first time anyway. So. Oh okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna fix that in post. Oh, are you? You're gonna, gonna look. Gonna, you look gonna look it, great too. You know, it, it sound says, too. Oh, is this going to be sent to Joseph Stater Strabi? <laughs> yeah, it's, you know, I'm it's just going to yeah. do jump cuts. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, yeah, I think I think that's that's for the for the theories. I think we okay, of the, the final secret, conclusion. Secrets, yeah. yeah, let's 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 move on. Let's finish this baby up. All right. Final conclusion. So I really enjoyed this movie. This this was even though it's two mo- two hours long keeps keeps being interesting by by dipping out of one storyline and continuing another one i think they really the pacing is really well done yeah, because it never not has you in its grip i think yeah and it, and it did it in a way that didn't even make you realize that was happening i mean it seems like everything is moving slow in the movie but yeah. it seems like it moved faster as a in movie. retrospective yeah, yeah as a movie itself so it was a good movie mm-hmm. um would you recommend watching it? I mean, it wasn't it? an action movie. No, would, definitely re- not an action movie. I, I would recommend watching it, especially if you speak German. German yeah. Well, or if you can get me. your hands on the English translation, because, again, that one is excellent. Yeah. Really well done, which, again, is... <sighs> the Austrian subtitle scene is such a mess. It's, it's, it's so bad with English subtitles. Even new releases nowadays sometimes don't get English subtitles, really? which is insane. Like... One of the most successful Austrian movies of this year yeah. had a Blu-ray release yeah. recently without? without English subtitles. Oh my god! Yeah, That's crazy. how is that? Even? And I know they have English subtitles because yeah. they uh, they it submitted it to international uh, okay. film festivals and they won stuff there too. Wow! And they have the English subtitles it's, because they showed them. That's, that's more their, of a stubbornness. Yeah, that's like yeah. fuck you. We are not yeah. giving it to you. That's, that's crazy. That's stupid. Oh, I hate it so much. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, this one is really well translated. Really well done. Ulrich Seidel again knocks it out of the park. This is 2001. It looks a little bit of its age, definitely. Mm, I mean, a it little it bit, but it's 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 late 2000s. Yeah. Ask me. But I think it could pass for late 2000s. Yeah. Just the style. So. Yeah, it's 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 very timeless yeah. in a way. It 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 doesn't. N- Again, you could watch but, this movie in twenty years, and those characters wouldn't have changed yeah, it significantly. Seems like it's, when you go out to the suburbs, things lose their color and become kind of drab, and 
it's probably always going to have that that impression on people. So I think yeah. it'll probably still be the kind of the thought of what suburbia is. Like even you look at movies. Yes. Like, like Edward Scissorhands when they go to the suburbs. Still just, the same. It just everything gets very geometric and very neat and yeah. And so and that song yeah, little so boxes. Yeah. So I, yeah, I think it'll stand the test of time. Mm-hmm. This movie. Suburbia will never change. Yeah. It's all. It's always gonna be a shit show. There you go. <laughs> all right, guys. Uh, Okello plugs. Where where can people find you? Uh, they can always find me at the tunnel usually. Yeah. Uh, in Vienna, and if you go great to, shows. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. If you go to Vienna, uh, Vienna's funniest stand up comedy on Facebook. Vienna's mm-hmm. funniest stand up comedy on Facebook. Link in the um, description below. Oh, there you go. Look down right there. There's a, there's a link. <laughs> thank you. Look down. Um, okay. Yeah. That link right there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so click that, and we do shows in English, uh, fortunately, now in Vienna. And we're one of the only comedy clubs in, in Vienna. Yeah. So Vienna's funniest stand up comedy. Yeah, and you have great great acts on every time. It's 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 a it's a smorgasbord of FFPÖ smorgasbord. alumni already. Yeah. 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 <laughs> It's cause there's not that many to choose from. So, so. <laughs> yeah, the pool is very yeah, shallow. Yeah. It's a high quality yeah. pool, but it's very shallow. <laughs> yes, it's very shallow. Like my feet I, aren't even wet. Yeah, exactly. Just the soles. Yeah. All right. Uh, thank you again. Uh, subscribe to our stuff, of course. Links in the description below. On the um, and yeah, um, see you the next time, guys. All right. Thanks Bye. for having me. Bye. <laughs>